G'day, today we're going to have a look at level 19 in Train Valley 2, at the radio station. Okay, so for this one we've got to do it in 14 and a half minutes, it's a long while. We can't destroy objects worth more than 15,000 total, and we can't stop any trains, that's usually a nice tricky one. Okay, so let's have a look. So we need to make um, 8 appliances, which is a new thing that we're creating here. So to make appliances we need copper ingots, and we need processed rubber and then we also need to get some processed rubber over there and some ingots so we need some uh, natural rubber to make that uh, and then we need some of the copper ore and then copper uh, some of the coal sorry to make the copper ore so okay so this is probably where we want to focus first um, now we're gonna have to make a bridge connection somewhere um, and I would say it probably is going to be here. That's a pretty expensive, because that would be a tunnel if to get through there. So we might be better off building a bridge somewhere different. Like, um, I suppose we can work up that hill. So we could maybe go there and have that come around. Because I think there we we can't really have this guy connect. So I think that that, I think that, that bridge is a waste, so we're just going to make that money back. I don't think it's usable. Alright, so what we'll do first is we will uh, get our connections going. So we want to try and avoid these things as well because we don't want to just waste money on pointless destruction. Uh, when we are having to be aware of it. Now that's the problem up there, that's going to be a lot of destruction, so we'll have to keep an eye on how we're doing there. Um, we'll work around that guy. Okay. Alright, so that should be enough to, to get going. So we'll start off, and we'll send just as many guys as we can to different places. So in total, if we need eight um, manufactured rubber for those appliances as well, we need in total 14 rubber, and we need to make in total 17 uh, copper ingots. Okay, so with the money that we've got, we might see how much it's going to cost us to build a bridge here. That's not that expensive. Um, so we might do that, because then we can get um, our copper bar, uh, ingots being made. Just pause it for a second while we figure this out. Okay, good. So we've got... Uh, now we've got that, we can... Now, we've got to be really careful when doing this, because most of the time you can set up two trains going from different directions to the same place and not worry about it, because you can always stop one. But we've got to remember that we can't stop trains here, so it's a bit more on the line when we are when we indifferently send a train like that. Still doing all right for the amount of things that we can destroy. So we'll set up our sewing factory. Uh, 
Um, once this guy arrives, then we'll start sending more coal this way. Let's also demolish those two for money. Let's have a look at the cost of a train across here. So we might go this one. So that means we can make nine ingots, so we don't need a total of 17. So if we've got nine worth of everything here and we need 17, then that's another eight. So we now need to send another two lots of guys here. And we need to send another one lot of guys down here. I might just do this in a way that it makes us avoid um, destroying any of those things, because just in case this is going to cost us a bit. What we'll do is we'll just start sending our um, whoop, ingots over here. Because we need a total of eight there. So we've got six going, and this is seven, and then eight. So if we send the next train as soon as the second one's ready, then we'll definitely only have to burn eight to go in that direction. So we can start sending more things here to finish them off. And that's good money that we're getting from sending these, so let's just chisel through. Second one has come down that hill. Uh, let's have a look. There we go. Let's see if we can come back one. Okay, so that's going that way, and then this guy we can send around the around. I'll just put it there for now. Oh, we're gonna, oh no, that's fine. It's only eight, isn't it? Okay, good. So we will send. Um, we might send just some guys over here. Actually, we might send these guys all the way around. Now we've made a little bit more money, because I'd say rubber's the last thing we're going to have finished here. So it would have been 14 rubber in total. I'll send... 8 more guys from here. It's a slow going because we have to send those trains so far. Hopefully they can make that first rubber quick so we don't lose a guy on here. Unfortunately there's nothing we can do to stop this guy to, to make sure he does arrive after that point. But I think it should be okay anyway. There we go, beautiful. Okay, so then we will send our copper down this way. We'll just do it with two first, just so we can build some, because we do need nine. Oh no, it doesn't matter, because we've already got one made. So we only need eight more. I 
once that guy arrives, we'll send off our last. Is it our last man that needs to arrive over there? So we've got nine. Uh, this guy will take us to 12. So we need two more. Okay, so we'll send the two of them over to make our rubber. We'll send this three here. And then, just in case I've done my math wrong, we'll send a set of workers here too. Also, buy a new train. Just double check to make sure that buying trains isn't one of our no nos for this level. Okay, then what we'll do is we will send um, three train loads of guys. over to the rubber factory. I might actually just wait for that one guy to arrive because um, I might send some rubber there next. Alright, so while that's happening, um, what we can do is we can send two loads of guys from here and plant them at the at the appliances store. We'll send out two lots of rubber. And we will start sending our ingots back to get these done. We might send him on to just fill that one some more. Send some guys on from here. and we'll start sending back our rubber. Okay, so what we'll do next is we'll send six more. Um, actually, if we've already done six, then we only need another. Um, we only need another eight, so we can send nine guys. Does also mean we can send this across. We are getting, we've got four minutes left from here, so we're doing all right. We just need to get all this made. Uh, we'll also send more guys this way. We've got more than enough workers, so we may as well just lose one sending it over, that's fine. Alright, so what we'll do is we'll send our rubber uh, and we'll send it straight through and just knock out the... Oh, actually, I might send the first one here. We'll just get continuing on building. Uh, but because we need six rubber over here, but this is going to be in groups of four, we're better off upgrading our trains to send those last two trains. I suppose trying to send like a train of three and then a train of one. 
but we'll send these through first because probably the longest thing we've got to go now is just building. So I'll flick him. Alright, so as soon as this guy is ready, we will send him. We'll then change that. We will also upgrade this train and send him out. Then we'll upgrade our next train and we will just wait out for these two to be made. There we go, five stars. Uh, nicely in time. Uh, if you're curious on my world rankings, that's how I did. Uh, any questions or comments, feel free to chuck them below. If you had a different strategy, especially in this bit over here, and if you did actually use that bridge, I'd love to hear it. Um, but apart from that, I will catch you later. See ya.